This image is one of the most iconic of all Hubble images called Mystic Mountain. And uh, it is a place of enormously active star formation. This entire pillar is about three light years in duration. That means it's so long that it takes light traveling at 186,000 miles per second. It takes it three years to go from bottom to top. And the entire area is filled with this really condensed uh, collection of dust and gas that's created this stellar nursery. We see on the outside edge here where the material is, is heated and evaporating off the surface uh, of the cloud, but you also have stellar winds that are sculpting this, like a, like a Michelangelo that would be sculpting a statue, knocking pieces of the nebula uh, off into interstellar space. So you have a mechanical sculpting process along with a heating process from the radiation coming off of the stars. So the two together are what uh, combine to create this gloriously detailed image. You see these jets coming out of two sides of that top pillar and down here again. Those are signatures of stars actually forming. Material is coming down, collapsing onto the star, it getting heated up, and when it tries to get out, it has to, to shoot out in jets. This bow shape, that is actually a shock wave from the material in the jet hitting the interstellar medium and heating it up. Uh, one, of, one of the best images, I think, that we've, we've gotten. But this one is just the right angle that you get a gorgeous view of it. It's, it's become an iconic image, I think, for several reasons. Uh, one is that it has such incredible detail in there, but also because it holds a fascination as being a place where we can actually see stellar systems forming before our eyes. It's also famous, I think, because of its sheer beauty. I mean, there's a lot of art in, in Hubble images. A, a large fraction of the value of Hubble is not just to give us the science uh, data that we need, but it's to appreciate the beauty of the universe.